The Jacksonville Science Festival is back at FSCJ and back by popular demand. I have the dream team, Dr. Evans, Dr. Sterling, and Victor to tell us all about this amazing event. Dr. Evans, I'm gonna start with you. What can kids expect? Kids can expect to be engaged in everything science, technology, engineering, art, and mathematics. And then Dr. Sterling, why is it important to get kids at a young age involved in science? It's all about discovery. If you're giving a student an opportunity to discover something new, it makes it relevant, there's retention that's involved, and uh, aha moments, and you just keep the interest of the student. And that's really important. Absolutely. And Victor, when it comes to experiments, you are the man, you're the director of the festival. You see this time and time again, the aha moments, mm. kids doing something and just having a blast. Uh, that is correct. This is a free event that we're going to have. It's going to be at two locations, uh, March the 2nd at the Seawalk Pavilion in the Jack's Beach and March uh, the 7th and 8th at FSCJ South Campus. And what are some of the experiments that people can actually see and participate in? There's going to be many hands-on experiments brought to you by FSCJ, JU, uh, the U.S. Army is going to be there, and it's just a way to say, ah, <laughs> that's actually also happening in Jacksonville, and that's something that they can invest in themselves. And it's backed by popular demand. This is the seventh year, correct? That is correct. It's the seventh year that we're having the Science Festival. All right. Now, today, we're all about being hands-on and learning. What do you have for us? I have a Mentos explosion with uh, soda over there that we're going to do later on afterwards. All right. All right. So if people want more information and they want to get involved, what's the best route to go? The best route is uh, visiting our website at jackscifest.com or .org. So www.jackscifest.org. All right. So I think it's time for us to take the walk over there. Are you guys going to stay here or come with? Or You're going to stay. Okay. So cheer us on. Cheer us on. All right. Ready, Second Victor? First, Thank right you. There. Put these on. I feel so legit whenever I put these glasses on. So inside here is this rock candy that we have in here in these tubes. And we're going to help me and just going to release these pins. And we're going to take a step back and watch the explosion occur. All right, before we go any farther than we are right now, what kind of reaction is this? Uh, it's actually a physical reaction. It's not actually a chemical reaction. There's actually dips inside the candy that allow the sugar inside the soda to actually get in. When that happens, an abundance of carbon dioxide gas starts to come out. This is so cool. This is science. How come they didn't have this set up when I was going to school? I have no idea, but at the Jacksonville Science Festival, you can see things like this. And so much more. All right, do we shake these up? Uh, no, not at all. Okay. We're basically okay. just removing the pins. It's just going to trap it down and have the uh, Mentos go down inside the uh, soda. Okay, just pull it, right? Yep. Ready? Three, two, one. All right, stick around, more to come right after this.